I started off as a kind of raging debate between myself, Jay, and another friend uh, actually turned into a bit of research. So we have a YouTube channel, and on that channel we explore the, the idea of what's the best glass to drink whiskey out of. Now, there is a lot of controversy online about people using the Turkish tea glass as a whiskey glass, saying that it's the most scientifically proven best whiskey glass on the planet. So what we did was we took a range of glasses of every type of whiskey glass that's pretty much on the market and we tested them all with the same whiskey. For some reason, this one is far better than the two most heralded whiskey glasses pretty much out there. Unanimously, as I said, you know, we found it to be the best experience. But the only thing holding it back was the size. You're drinking a thimble of whiskey out of something that's more comparable to a shot glass at a bar. And we wanted to see whether that could be translated to something much more akin to what a whiskey drinker should be drinking out of. And that's where Tiago Russo comes in. My name is Tiago Russo, and I am the design director for Craft Irish Whiskey. I've worked in the past with the likes of Macallan, Royal Brackler, or Dalmore, amongst many, many others. It's all about research. And more often than not, it's all about researching outside of the box. For you only to be able to, to innovate, truly innovate, you have to research and to understand everything that already is, so you're able to create something that there isn't. The science and research that's gone into each component uh, has been second to none. If you take our glass range, for example, our vision was to develop and create the perfect whiskey glass, the perfect pour and the perfect taste. With the Turkish tea glass, we discovered that one of the main features that it could offer that other whiskey glasses or other different type of glasses couldn't offer is the fact that you stop, almost immediately stop feeling any kind of ethanol. I'm just so blown away every time I smell of a Turkish tea glass. You get zero alcohol vapor. It's like none of it's there. Do you reckon obviously the thickness of the glass is going to attribute to it? Because obviously this is, you know, this is a Turkish tea glass. Can have anything too thin. It was never designed for whiskey, it was never right? Never designed for whiskey. Traditional, ancient tea glass drunk in the Middle East and in Turkey for centuries. It left no ethanol on the nose and in the palate it was really, you know, kind of uh, accentuating the kind of tones there. There is obviously the, the shaping attached to it, which uh, is also a part, a very important part of design, but the lack of ethanol that you feel in the Turkish tea glass, it's due to the glass itself being made from soda lime glass, which is a type of glass that contains no metals whatsoever, in contrast to usually the crystal glasses that contains a lot of lead, which as a, a metal automatically alters the taste of any whiskey or any beverage inside. With Tiago Rosso, our head designer, uh, we set him the task of actually seeing whether we could blow up the dimensions of something this small, something much more handheld and compact, and the results were outstanding. The goal in designing these glasses was to exalt the whiskey tasting experience to a level never accomplished before. We have blended science and artistry into what is a uniquely designed masterpiece, from the shaping to the material. It's all about the performance, ensuring that you encounter no ethanol, only the exquisite flavors and notes of the whiskey.